Hi folks, I have a, a radio here, it's called a Capo DX5000 uh, and basically it's a um, 10 meter radio which covers 28 to 29 but what we want to do with the radio is we want to just change it change, see if I can switch it around for the camera what we want to do to the radio is we want to a wide band the radio so it actually covers 11 meters as well so what we've done is uh, what I've already done is I've installed the data cable in the radio which comes out here because you can actually access the radio to your PC and you can change frequencies and all that kind of stuff um, and I'll show you some pictures because it's already done I'll show you some pictures of what you have to do but basically it's straightforward you have to take the top case off take the bottom case off plug in the actual data cable it only goes on one part of the radio inside and then run the cable out to the to the back part there you can see that on the camera and that means that you have your data cable installed and you can actually access it now for this wide banding of the radio so you can do 25 to 29 i think is um around the frequencies that you can get when you wide band it you have to do a few things and unfortunately i can't hold it up to the camera and do it at the same time so you'll have to just bear with me okay so what I'm going to try and do is follow the instructions as per the manufacturer's settings so turn off the radio so the radio is off at the moment press the function S or F buttons together I'm holding these buttons turn on the radio right so it says band it comes up with band 1 and apparently you change it to band 2 by, by turning the channel switch and when you have selected the correct band press the function button the display will show res res and then end and then what you do is switch off the radio I assume. and then we'll switch it back on we have all the bands so let me just show you this on camera okay so you have the function key here and the SRF button there see it's it's that one there okay so what you do is you hold them two down like that and then you switch on the radio and then you use the channel button it'll come up with one band and then you use the channel switch here to change it to second band because the first band is only 10 meters which is 28 and 29 and the second band is then it's wide open so you put it on to the second band and then you press hold down the function key and it put, comes up with R E S and then it comes with comes up with R E N D and when you see the R E N D come up you then switch it off and then switch it back on and then you'll find and I'll power this up now. There you go, it's on twenty seven there. Now originally that was Go down the bands just 26 25 goes down to 25 now originally when they when this was switched on um, before the modification it was just shown 28 and 29 but now it's doing 25 all the way up the bands to 27 to 9 and obviously if you go up in the channels there they'll go up into the 28s so it still did two it still did ten meters, but now it's opened up for CB radio. 
So that's how to do the modification. I'll put the instructions of how to do the modification in the video description below. And that's how you modify the KPO DX5000 to wideband it. So it covers 11 meters. You can reset it back, by the way. There's a default setting that you can set it back if you want. Um, if you want to do that as well. Cheers.